Mighty Morphin Learning. Hi kids, my name is Mighty Morph and I can change into anything I want. Today, I'm going to change into some three-dimensional shapes so that you can learn how they fit into the world around us. Everywhere you look, there are many 3D shapes. One of the most common ones is the sphere, which is a perfectly round object. Here, I'll show you. Sphere. Can you name something that has the shape of a sphere? What about the Earth? Or even a soccer ball? Although not perfectly round, they sure look like spheres to me. You gotta hand it to the sphere for always bouncing back. My favorite shape is called a torus. Do you want to see it? Torus. In fact, I just ate a torus for breakfast. Can you guess what it was? A donut. My skateboard wheel also resembles a torus. The next shape is called a pyramid, which has five sides. Four of them tend to converge to a point, and it looks like this. Pyramid. Have you ever seen pictures of the Great Pyramids in Egypt? Looks like somebody lost a lot of weight. And it was shaped like a pyramid too. The next shape is a surface or solid bounded by two parallel planes and generated by a straight line moving parallel to the given planes and tracing a curve bounded by the planes and lying in a plane perpendicular or oblique to the given planes. Or as I like to call it, a cylinder. Cylinder. I'll bet you've seen lots of cylinders. What about a flashlight? Or this famous leaning building? Do you see a cylinder shaped instrument here? You're right, a drum. The next shape is called a cone and it tapers smoothly from its base to a point. Do you want to see it? Cone. I'll bet you know whose droopy cone hat this belongs to. Last night I had a dream I was a knight living in a castle. Do you see any cones on my castle? The last shape is called a cuboid, which is a closed box composed of three pairs of rectangular faces placed opposite each other. Cuboid. I use cuboids to make this cool race car. I also love to build things using my plastic cuboid blocks. The cylinders on top hold them together. Well, it's time for me to break out of here. I hope you had fun learning about 3D shapes and thanks for all your help. Don't forget to subscribe for more Mighty Morphin Learning. Hello, 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 hello.